of the day to you great and wonderful people of biafra lovers of freedom all over the world you are welcome once again commander holy ghost who is part of the commanders in osu camp in uh Olu state has briefed us uh that the intruders have come again today and the battle has started we are going to hear the voice of commander holy goose as he informs us of what is currently happening uh in Olo state today also the prime minister of the biafra republic government in exile the person of ekba simon and joko has also stated that the 72 hours ultimatum given to the nigerian government to release mazenam the Kano on the condition of his health status that this 72 hours has elapsed and as such there would be consequences for their actions and if i can me oko guide you over very soon and so let's go into the news proper if you are a new subscriber can you click on the red subscribe button turn on your notification bell so that you get information of any of our videos and informations that will be posted on this platform also like very importantly like and then share um, our videos to get wide and get to everyone that it needs to get to if you are not informed you are deformed let's listen to commander holy ghost breaking news good morning fellow beer friends good morning lovers of freedom I wish all the good beer friends a happy new moon. Yeah, this very morning, as it's time standing now, five minutes to the hours of 11, the enemy, the intruder, the terrorists, those who are good in killing innocent civilians have come this morning with the Kanu fighter jet, as usual, they have thrown their bomb, but of no avail. So stay tuned. Today is a first, first match, uh, 2024. Nigeria cannot match us. They can never. So therefore, there is a war going on right now so let's face the war squarely and get you back the information later that come that they might die today is our fall and our fall will swallow them that is what we know this is the land of our ancestors we can never leave it to anybody so therefore we go nowhere. In this land of our ancestors, we must defend it till the, till the last. And nothing anybody can do about it. So therefore, those who come to our land with death, shall they meet death. Those who come to our land with peace, shall they meet peace. Those who are in our land to take our land, their life will be taken. Those who are in our land to bless our land, our land will bless them. So anything you carry come into this blessed land of Biafra, now what thing you go get at the end of the day. So good people of Biafra, as the moon just started today, the evil have come and the evil must be destroyed darkness can never comprehend light we are the children of light and no darkness can take over our land as they come so shall they disappear because we are the indigenous people the real owners of the land we will see remain here forever and ever we go nowhere so remain blessed while we face the enemy so wonderful people you have heard commander holy ghost once more he has said that the people the intruders are back to Olo, 
and the battle line has been drawn again and uh, the music has started so let us continue to do everything within our powers to support these men let us continue to do everything within our powers to pray for them to encourage them to ensure that we stand by them side by side to give them every moral support that they need to conquer and to win this battle it is time for us to now take the mission take the sermon to them it is time i believe the prime minister has to do something has to say something so that this ministration would be taken to them they have come to us so many countless times and we believe strongly that the time has come for us to also um, pay them a little visit over good little little visit in one of their major major outlets let us pay them a little visit Mm -hmm. little visit with the an uh, enough anointing water and uh, uh, praises so that when they receive that they would repent eh? they will repent a little those who want to repent because you know when you do your ministration some people will repent some people will not want to repent so those ones who are stubborn not to repent uh, they will be the ones who will go to the next time so at least let us just minister once mm -hmm. let's go for out uh, outreach outreach let's minister to them let's pour holy water on them because it is time they have uh, come so much to olo and it is time the olo state begins to you know minister to them also pay them in the same coin they have been paying us for a long time so let us also listen to the news coming from the prime minister biafra republic government in exile and he says that the 72 hours ultimatum to release Mazen Namdekanu for medical treatment ends today. And just as usual, we've opened the gates. Welcome to the month of March, the month of the highest dragon fire. This is signifying that the ultimatum given to them to release Mazen Namdekanu on the grounds of his health condition has expired. And as such, the people shall take drastic measures to ensure that uh, the administration and the uh, message gets to the government. They need to understand what we are talking about. They need to understand what is happening. They need to ensure that... Uh, the needful is done. You cannot just keep this man uh, in detention just like that without doing anything, without any positive, uh, you know, result coming anytime soon. This is how many years? Getting to three years, you have kept him in solitary confinement. You have, you know, abused him. You have abused his rights. You have abused every privilege. You have abused every international treaty, every international law. You have done and you, have, you, you continue to do evil. So it is time we begin to reciprocate all that you have been doing. It is time the people begin to sing praises, to sing a very wonderful sermon. It is time for us to do this. And we want to use this opportunity to plead to our people. Those ones who have, a, 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 you know, who are glutons, who cannot see money and close their eyes. Please stay away from the Biafran struggle. Allow people who have the zeal to fight for Biafra to do so. If you know you are going to receive money from the enemies, please leave us. Please leave the Biafra struggle. It is not for you. Allow people who are determined to get this Biafra to do what they need to do. Do not come in, do not always come to receive money and uh, 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 sabotage the people. Stop it. If you are part of this, stop it immediately. Stop it immediately. Stop it immediately. All this sabotage must stop. All we are doing is for the betterment of our people and for the betterment of our children unborn. I do not see any reason why somebody who has sense would want to sabotage his own people. Look around you. What is happening in Nigeria? Is it what you want for your people? Is it what you want for your children? Is it what you want for your people, for your generations to come? That they will not have a say in their own country? That they cannot amount to anything in their own country? That they cannot aspire to be the president of their own country? Why are you sabotaging the people who are trying to fight for a better life for you? 
it is time that everybody anybody who is considered a saboteur should be you know dealt with decisively and not just dealt with decisively so this is the news at the moment and we will continue to bring you credible informations and the facts as they continue to filter into our newsroom thank you very much for listening uh kindly share widely to get to others and kindly like 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 and you know drop your comments if you are a new subscribe if you're a new member to this family kindly click on the red subscribe button and click on your notification bell to get every information that comes from this channel thank you so much biafra fest biafra fest biafra fest